yeah, I just wanted to record a few mental notes here. Little observations that I've taken while staying here in the beautiful Punta Cana Resort here, the Gran Bahia. Um, and during our little travels with our expeditions and whatnot. Um, A, they have hot milk served with coffee. Why the fuck don't we have that in Canada? Seriously. We keep cooling down our coffee with this cold milk or cold cream. It should be boiling hot just like theirs. That's fucking amazing shit. The coffee down here is great. I'm almost thinking about losing my passport. <laughs> but, on a butt note, don't get butt hurt over this if you are a cop. The cops down here, they seem pretty chill. At first I was thinking maybe they're just not doing their jobs. But then I started thinking, they're actually sitting out in the open on the highways. They are, they have their lights on, especially at night, probably so you can actually find them in case you need help. And um, even when they're driving down the road, they got their lights on. Tour bus passes them. Vehicles pass them. I think they're just trying to remind people, we're out here. Don't speed. Don't kill yourselves. It's pretty cool. I actually saw a cop with the lights on his truck, and he was just laying on the hood, just chilling. That's pretty fucking cool. The drivers out here, at first, I thought they were reckless. I thought we were going to die. They fucking drive so close to everything. They drive so close to the traffic. And they seem like all like, they're like hogs. Like they're just trying to <coughs> steal space and shit. But apparently, they're better drivers than in Canada. And the U.S. They don't need much space on the roads. A lot of them have small cars, but even though the big ones, they don't need space. They know where the fuck they're going. They don't hit nothing. I haven't seen anybody hit anything yet. It's awesome. There's obviously a few accidents here and there, but these guys know how to fucking drive, man. Not even kidding you. Fuck, they come like inches away from each other's vehicles. Never touch each other. They know where the fuck their vehicle are. They're fucking zipping in and out of traffic. Perfect. Just perfect. We need to get, like, driving skills like that in Canada. Seriously. You ever see some of the motherfuckers on the road in Canada? Motherfuckers shouldn't be on the road. No. Yeah. So, anyways. Those are a couple of my personal observations. Peace.